I was playing international hockey for, for ages and then I had a jaw injury. So couldn't do any contact sport for like 10 weeks. So then I just started to just pedal on the bike because obviously being a super active person, I can't just sit there and do nothing. So I'm just pedaling on the, on the bike. And then I did my first CrossFit session. And I think the first CrossFit session was like run 5K for time, which is my jam, hockey, running. Like I was like, oh man, if this is what CrossFit is, this is, this is cool. And I've got a very like motivating kind of mind frame. So I'm like, things are hard. I want to get better at them. I've always been a competitive person, like in a good way. Like I, I love to train with people, but I always want to better myself. However that is, I just always want to better myself. That was my driving factor at that stage. Um, and then I think post having Hunter, just priorities change. Motivates me now, him, I suppose. I'm gonna be all teary in this, that's not good. <laughs> it's totally fine, it's all good. Oh, like before having him, I would just like, not mean to, but have so much pressure on myself because I wanted to better myself. But after having him, it's just, yeah, priorities change. He becomes the main focus. CrossFit kind of becomes second focus. So all pressure goes. And then when, when there's no pressure, you do so much better. My hopes and dreams in CrossFit, I suppose, is like I said before, just to do the best I know I am capable of. Like that doesn't mean like I want to be number one in the world. Like that'd be cool, of course, but like, I just want to reach my maximum capacity and capability. Alright, I'm back on track. <laughs> Y'all ask questions about her son? Yeah! yeah. Oh, holy man! <laughs> <laughs> Don't do that! <laughs>